greatest free pleasure in the world. When you got to pee, you go in the bathroom, whatever your problems was when you walked in, for the next minute to two minutes, they just don't fucking matter. Uh, so it's, you know, do it. And just try not to walk right in front of the stage on a punchline. That's all I have, you know. And, uh, oh, and I should say this. Uh, for the last year or so, more people have been coming to see me live who've never seen me live before. And they come, I think, because maybe they've seen me make the odd TV appearance. I've been doing stand-up 12, 13 years. And uh, based on seeing the TV appearance, they come to the live show full of hopes and dreams and <laughs> expectations. And they leave broken, disillusioned, <laughs> destroyed. I just want to point out to you that stand-up comedy is art. TV is business. <laughs> and yeah, this is, this is like my sixth um, Edinburgh show. I'm proud of that, man. I love coming to this festival, man. You get to be around some of the best comedians in the world. How do you not get better? Like my dad used to say, if you are around shit, you will become shit. <laughs> my father's a ghetto Jedi. <laughs> or as we call them, Jedi's. And um... And um, as usual, I've had some difficulty getting the title and the poster of my show into the brochure. Uh, this is not the first time it's happened. Uh, the name of the show is Trophy Nigger. And yeah, there's some people in the world who still got